Unit 10 Endangered Species A. Reading While you read, read the text, then do the tasks that follow. Page 107 Endangered species are plant and animal species which are in danger of extinction. Over 8,300 plant species and 7,200 animal species around the globe are threatened with extinction, and many thousands more become extinct each year before biologists can identify them. The primary causes of species extinction are habitat destruction, commercial exploitation, and pollution. The drainage of wetlands, cutting of forests, urbanization, and road and dam construction have destroyed or seriously damaged natural habitats. Since the 1600s, worldwide commercial exploitation of animals for food and other products has seriously reduced the number of rare species. Toxic chemicals in the air and land, contaminated water, and increased water temperatures have also driven many species to the verge of extinction. Plant and animal extinction leads to a loss of biodiversity. Maintaining biodiversity is important for us in many ways. For example, humans depend on species diversity to have food, clean air and water, and fertile soil for agriculture. In addition, we benefit greatly from the many medicines and other products that biodiversity provides. Different conservation efforts have been made in order to save endangered species. The Red List, a global list of endangered and vulnerable animal species, has been introduced to raise people's awareness of conservation needs. Governments have enacted laws to protect wildlife from commercial trade and overhunting. A number of wildlife habitat reserves have been established so that a wide range of endangered species can have a chance to survive and develop. Task 1. Listen to the passage and choose the best answer, A, B, C, or D, to each question. For a long time, the image most people had of a gorilla was a dangerous-looking animal with big, bared teeth. But researchers studying gorillas show a very different picture of mountain gorillas. The animals are peaceful, gentle, sociable, and mainly plant-eating creatures. Gorillas live in family groups. A typical group is led by the biggest and strongest grown-up male gorilla. He is called a silverback because the hair on a man's back turns from black to silvery gray as he grows up. A silverback's group usually includes one or two sub-adult males and a few females and their young. Mountain gorillas spend much of their time eating. Their food includes a variety of plants, along with a few kinds of insects and worms. At night, the animals make a nest to sleep in. Many lightweight gorillas nest in trees. The heavier ones may nest in grasses on the ground. Babies sleep with their mothers at night. Life for mountain gorillas is not always peaceful. They are endangered and threatened by civil wars in the smaller parts of Africa. Hunters kill them for food. Their forests are cut down for farmland, fuel, and housing. But many scientists, forest rangers, and other concerned people are working hard to protect mountain gorillas and their habitats. Part C. Listening. Page 111. Listen and repeat. Gorilla Bared teeth, sociable, silverback, subadult, civil war, nest, forest rangers. Part C. Listening. Page 111. 
Listen and repeat. Gorilla, bared teeth, sociable, silverback, sub adult, civil war, nest, forest rangers. Part C Listening, page 111. Listen and repeat. Gorilla, bared teeth, sociable, silverback, sub adult, civil war, nest, forest rangers. Part E Language Focus, page 114. Pronunciation Practice reading the following sentences. Paying attention to the stressed syllables. 1. Tell me the time. 2. Show me the way. 3. He bought some carrots and cabbages. 4. Come for a swim. 5. Look at the clock on the mantelpiece. 6. I think he wants to go tomorrow. 7. It's not the one I want. 8. Most of them have arrived on the bus. 9. Walk down the path to the end of the canal. 10. I'm going home today for Christmas. 11. A bird in the hand. Is worth two in the bush. Twelve. If you don't have the best, make the best of what you have. Test Yourself D. Page 116. Listening. Listen to the passage and complete the note with no more than three words. High in dense bamboo forests in the misty mountains of southwestern China lives one of the world's rarest mammals, the panda. Pandas feed mainly on bamboo shoots and leaves. Occasionally they eat other plants, fish, or small animals. Pandas eat fast and they eat a lot. They spend about 12 hours a day doing it. Pandas are in extreme danger today. There are only about 600 of these black and white bears in the wild and a hundred in captivity. One of the reasons is that the survival rate of the cubs is very low. More than half of them die shortly after birth. The Chinese government is considering cloning the panda in their efforts to save this animal. Test Yourself D. Page 116. Listening. Listen to the passage and complete the note with no more than three words. High in dense bamboo forests. In the misty mountains of southwestern China lives one of the world's rarest mammals, the panda. Pandas feed mainly on bamboo shoots and leaves. Occasionally they eat other plants, fish, or small animals. Pandas eat fast and they eat a lot. They spend about 12 hours a day doing it. Pandas are in extreme danger today. There are only about 600 of these black and white bears in the wild and a hundred in captivity. One of the reasons is that the survival rate of the cubs is very low. More than half of them die shortly after birth. The Chinese government is considering cloning the panda in their efforts to save this animal.